Hello guys and welcome back to new Applied Energistics 2 tutorial and in this episode we want to take a look at the self workbench and the cell workbench is created by 5 iron ingots, 1 chest, 2 wools and at least 1 calculation processor and um, you don't need to um, connect it to your ME system so um, just right click on the cell workbench and you have an interface like this and um, you need the cell workbench to configure your storage cells specifically that means um, if we and take our uh, 64k me storage cell and put in some stone on the, in, on this field here um, we have partitioned our storage cell that means um, that we are only able to store in some stone um, we will try it with this me drive and we can take a look and if I want to put in some storage cells or some swords or flint and steel you can see nothing happens that um, means um, because we have configured it as stone and um, stone we can um, put in. Um, you have so also seen that we have a lot of um, fields where we can place in some items. So um, you can use a lot of filters here and um, use it like that. And um, the second one um, where you can, where you need the cell workbench is to configure the creative um, ME storage cell. That means um, if we take a look at our creative ME storage cell and if we place in some stone, we have infinity, um, infinity stone like this. We will need to place in the creative ME storage cell and you can see we have infinity stone like this. Yeah, and um, that's um, what even um, how you can use the cell workbench. Thanks for watching and bye.